Good morning, it's 12 o'clock. Hey, let me turn my fan off. Ah, off. Okay, it's 12 o'clock. Um, it's Monday. We're doing a week in the life vlog, I've decided. Because you guys said you want longer vlogs. And honestly, I don't do too much in the day to make a long vlog out of one day. So we're doing a week. Um, I initially didn't plan on working out today. <clears throat> we'll see how that goes. But I woke up this morning. I literally look a mess. I actually woke up really early. I don't know why I've just started filming. But um, I just ordered a salad. And um, I'm going to get out of bed and eat that in a minute. <laughs> and then I'm going to record my podcast. And then I'm going to figure things out for the rest of the week. But... It is Soul Cup at Soul Cycle, which means you give yourself like a target um, of like 10, 15, 20, 25, up to 50 rides to complete in a month. And then they donate like a portion to charity and you can win prizes. It's a whole thing. I'm a very competitive person. So I have signed up for the most classes, which is 50 classes in 30 days. So we shall see how that goes because there is one day in December that I know I can't ride. Um, which means I'm going to have to like triple on a day, but I can do that. I can do that. I'm excited. I love a challenge, but then also I'm like, oh, should I have just put my goal as 10 rides, which I initially did. And everyone was like, Mary, shut up. You do like 10 rides in two days, which is very true. But if I don't hit 50 rides, I'm the type of bitch that's going to start crying. So we shall see. I'm literally resting this on my coffee machine. So if it falls, it falls. But anyways. This is my salad. Um, oh God, I walked into stinging nettles the other day and my leg still really hurts. Anyway, um, I would really like to know why the other day <clears throat> when I got a salad from the salad project, they had the Christmas menu there and it was like bacon Brussels sprouts and I fucking love Brussels sprouts. So I got them and it was so good. And the beets and parsnips are also on the Christmas menu. And today they only had beets and parsnips. They didn't have Brussels sprouts. Anyway, I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos, eat my salad, and I think I'm gonna work out today. Oh, I just can't be trusted. I just woke up from a nap. It's 4 p.m. Made a smoothie though. Um, oh God, my prebiotic, probiotic, berry powder which is green for some reason didn't blend great anyway um yeah gonna have this smoothie and then go to whole foods and get like a protein bar or some dried mango or something then i'm gonna go to my friend's house and we're just gonna have a little catch up but i'm not working out two workouts tomorrow and seeing my best friend <laughs> but yeah okay so i bathed which is something bathed brushed my teeth washed my hair i need to put some leave-in conditioner in then I'm gonna head to my friend's house. I think I'm gonna go to um, Whole Foods first and get a protein bar or something because I had a smoothie and like, I'm full, but I'm still a little hungry, but not like dinner hungry. Like I'm not eating a full meal, otherwise I'll feel very ill. Sometimes I say things, I'm like, you didn't actually need to say that. Some things are meant to be internal thoughts. Anyway, yeah, that's the plan. Um, I only gotta walk over to Piccadilly Circus, so. I've still got like an hour before I need to leave. But yeah, baby. And then I've got two workouts tomorrow. Um, 8.15 and 6.30. And I think I already said, but my best friend is going to the 6.30 and I haven't seen her in a while and I'm so excited. So yeah. I just watched the previous clip back, like the one, the penultimate clip, not previous. And I mentioned that I was getting a protein bar and then I said it again. So for a third time, I'm gonna get a protein bar. Watch me not even get a protein bar. I'll get like fucking pizza chips or something. <laughs> okay, yeah, my hair actually doesn't look good. Oh God, so much leave-in conditioner. Um, but I'm gonna head out now. Um, it's like quarter past seven, so I need to be there at half past. This is the jacket I'm wearing. <clears throat> literally like i'm not even doing anything we're just gonna go and have like a little catch up sit in her living room talk gossip you know whatever um but i honestly like haven't even seen another human being today so it's probably good for me to go um 
and yeah we'll probably plan like what soul cycle classes we're going to take together this week but oh where are my keys yeah. do i need my purse or oh, probably uh yeah that's the plan see ya it's midnight and i'm heading home now i have soul cycle at 8 a.m <laughs> It is so fucking cold right now and I'm literally in sweats and a coat. Like I'm dressed appropriately for November and it's so cold. But anyways, London is cute. But yeah, I'm walking home um, and I forgot my keys. So I have in fact made my parents stay up for me. <laughs> the whole world revolves around me. Good morning. I am in fact wearing the exact same jumper I was wearing yesterday because I am obsessed with it. But I'm on my way to Soul Cycle right now. It's fucking freezing. I need a coat. Didn't wear one, obviously. But yeah, let's go work out, baby. <laughs> Let's shut that door. Um, what's up, guys? <laughs> I just got home. I'm gonna make a protein shake. Oh my god, my hair. Because this morning I woke up at like quarter to seven. Class doesn't start till eight. And I was like, plenty of time. Tell me why I just sat in bed. Didn't do anything, just sat in bed. And then I was like, oh, I'm late and my smoothie will not digest in time if I have it now. So having a protein shake now probably gonna make like some eggs and avocado as well um don't have any oats i probably should have got some oats literally was out of my house could have gone to whole foods but no my brain cells didn't kick in so yeah but yeah great workout saw my some of my favorite people um took abby's class obviously <sighs> that's it really Let's go make a shake. Plot twist, I'm not as dumb as I thought I was. Yesterday, I bought some um, like protein pancake mix and I forgot that I bought it. So I made some protein pancakes. Kind of looks like shit. My whole downstairs is so smoky because I burnt my pancakes. But that's, that's okay, because I hope they taste good. Also made a protein shake. Getting these gains. My booty better come through. Anyway, I'm gonna eat this now. Mm -hmm. Guess he just woke up from another nap. It was me. <laughs> um, actually, I didn't just wake up. I've been awake for about an hour and I ate some um, eggs and spinach and avocado. Um, but it's 3 p.m. now and I'm gonna put some workout clothes in the laundry. In the laundry, in the fucking washing machine. And then I have to wash the dishes. Oh, I hate washing dishes. I have to wash the dishes. Otherwise, does anyone else's parents do this? My mom will literally compete with me. Like, she will not wash my dishes. Like, okay, get it. But, like, she will just leave them there. Like, she will wash all of her dishes and then leave mine in the sink. And then won't say anything to me, just being passive aggressive. And then a few days later, she'll be like, oh. People are so ungrateful in this house. Say my name! Say my name! Say it! Say it with your chest! Ugh. So yeah, I gotta wash the dishes. <laughs> and before I went to bed, I put the heating... Before I went to bed. What is wrong with me? I took a nap. I didn't go to bed. Um, but I put the heating on full blast and now I've got my fan on. So my mom's probably gonna get home and be like, You're wasting gas and electricity! Blah, 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 blah. Girly... I'm just trying to find the correct temperature. The correct temperature. And I haven't found it yet. Hence why the fan is still on. Making noise. Look at all this mascara. Anyway. Oh. Okay, let me go put my clothes in the wash. Because we're doing three workouts tomorrow. And I don't have a cute fit. I still haven't bought any hair. <clears throat> I still haven't bought any hair gel. So um, I'm having to ride with my hair out again. Which is not fun. But I'm going to SoulCycle now, and my best friend Sophie's coming. I've said this many times, I'm so excited to see her. Also, Noor's riding, who's one of my really good friends. 
and we're taking Abby's class, who's also one of my really good friends. <laughs> I don't know who else is riding, to be fair. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I had another protein shake. I actually don't know if you're meant to consume this much protein in a day. Your face is in the corner there. <laughs> So I just got back from Soul Cycle and I saw my best friend and we had a little catch up and we made plans to go out next week because she's like a big girl now. She's got a big girl job, like a fucking nine to five. Well, I'm nine to three, but yeah, we can't drink on Wednesdays anymore like we used to. So we had to make plans and we're going out next week and I'm so excited. Um, class was amazing, obviously. And yeah, three Soul Cycle classes tomorrow, baby. Let's do the damn thing. But I just put my dinner in the microwave, some chicken and rice. It's the only thing I could find in the fridge, to be honest, and I didn't want to make my own food. Pardon me. Uh, yeah, and I'm going to eat that, go to bed, wake up tomorrow, and do this again. Good morning. It's 8 a.m. It's Wednesday, I think. And I actually, like, slept uninterrupted for about eight hours, which is really rare, but I just know my body is so tired. Um, so I'm kind of happy that my workout this morning is at 10 as opposed to 7am or 8am like I normally do. So yeah, I got some, got some sleep. Watch me still nap. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go make a protein smoothie just because yesterday I felt a bit faint, um, during my morning class, probably because I didn't eat anything. I normally don't eat before a workout, but if my energy is really low, then I should. Otherwise, I just feel like I'm going to pass out. What the fuck is this? Oh, actually, that didn't sound too too healthy. Um, But yeah, so I'm going to go make a protein shake. Oh, I don't have any oat milk. Fuck. Um, and then I'm going to take my antidepressants and my vitamin D. Don't forget to take your vitamin D supplements, especially with daylight savings, because the sun is not up long enough for you to get your vitamin D, okay? I take gummies because I don't like taking tablets. Um, and I already have to take my antidepressants, so that's enough tablets for one day. So I take the gummies, I'll show you. They're from Holland and Barrett. My mum buys them bulk because I think I've said this before, but if you think I'm a health nut, you should meet my mother. Um, yeah, I need to drink some water as well. Let's get on with this Wednesday. I think I'm gonna go and get breakfast from this place in Shoreditch called um, Oatopia. It's in the Box Park. Like, uh, if you're from London, you know, but like Shoreditch Box Park has like a rooftop bit with a bunch of restaurants. And then the main drag, which has a bunch of storefronts on the main road. And it's one of the ones on the main drag, so. I think after class, I'm gonna go get some oats. They have one called Muscle Up, and it's oats, coconut milk, almond butter, maple syrup, banana, and blueberries, which is technically what I would make for myself for breakfast, but sometimes it's nice to have someone make your breakfast for you. So I'm gonna go and get that. My alarm went off whilst I was filming the last clip, but that's probably a good sign that I should just shut up and get on with the day. So let's do the damn thing. Okay, here's the morning routine antidepressant vitamin d3 i take one before breakfast and one after breakfast because it says you should take it with food and i literally never know what that means so it's just like having a Haribo when you wake up in the morning. Um, when the child lock still gets you at 23. Actually, let's pick out an outfit. Um, oh, I don't really want to wear this. Um, can my hood stay up, please? It's cold. Actually, no, I am going to wear this. I don't like wearing these anymore because they're too big for me. 
They're a size 6. And when I got them, I thought I was a size 6. Obviously. But now I wear a 4. First world problems, huh? Anyway, I was gonna wear this and let's see. Maybe I could pair it with this sports bra. Yeah, that could be cute. Um, I'm gonna put my sweatpants on top of it because it's so fucking cold. Like I have actually learned my lesson. It's taken me three days of this freezing cold week to realize it's actually freezing cold and I do need to dress weather appropriate. Otherwise I will get sick. Um, sorry, I left my castor oil on the windowsill. Anyway, I just made my shake with water because I don't have any oat milk. Do people do this? Cause this is fucking disgusting. Still haven't gone out to buy any hair gel. So riding with my, <laughs> riding with my hair out again. Um, I tie it up in the middle of class. I just like, don't come in with it slicked back because I <laughs> cannot slick it back. <sighs> mm, what do I need? Lip balm. Oh my God, everything's pink. Fun fact, I used to hate the color pink. I think this is like the first pink item of clothing I've ever owned. No, that's a lie. Owned and purchased for myself in my own adult years. Okay. Um, do I have my keys? I need my keys because no one's gonna be home. Where the fuck are my keys? Where are my keys? Oh, they're my keys. Okay. Gonna go to Soul Cycle now. I am on my way to Soul Cycle and I just realized I forgot a bottle of water. Okay, I'm in Shoreditch, um, about to get some oats. Oh my god, I can see the place. Got my oats. Honestly, I love not making my own breakfast. Mm. This is good. Well, I had a bath and got... <clears throat> Why does my voice keep breaking? Had a bath and got changed into my new work outfit. And I'm having a late lunch because I had a late breakfast. Just burnt protein pancakes again. <laughs> I literally love the concierge at my friend's house. Like, he is so sweet. He always makes my day whenever I come here. Also, what is my hair? Did my last two soul cycle classes of the day. Obviously, they were a vibe. It's Miss Abby Ashley. It's always a vibe. But the last class was Drake versus Usher, which was like extra vibe. I now hate the word vibe. But I'm on my way home and it's really dark. Oh my God, I just saw statues of people and I thought there were people watching me fan behavior but it was statues so not really fan behavior okay let's stop being a narcissist she's home after a long day not my coat and my leggings, just chilling and chopped. I, I don't have the energy to move them. But yeah, I'm back home, baby. Um, tomorrow, doing three cell cycle classes again. Um, but there's like a big gap in between them. There was a gap today, but I like went and got breakfast and stuff. So by the time I got back home, I only had a few hours before I went back out. And I actually went to my friend's house, so... That was my own fault. Um, but I think I want to nap tomorrow in between classes. Uh, so it's 8.15, 11.30 and 6.30, but the 8.15 and the 11.30 are in two different studios. So I might actually just walk over. I think it's like a 45, maybe an hour. 45 minutes or an hour. I'm not too sure to walk from Soho to Notting Hill. Actually, is it that long? I think it's like half an hour on the bus. It's like 15 minutes on the tube. But I have time to kill, so I might like shower at Soul Cycle, you know, take advantage of all their bougie La Labo um, conditioners and shampoos and stuff. Even though they literally don't have like any conditioner that I would use. Like, I really do like the La Labo 
conditioner. Um, but you know, girl is black. Uh, I need some sort of leave-in conditioner. Like a simple washout conditioner is not doing it. You know, maybe we should get a pre-poo in there. Doubt anyone at Souls like knows what pre-poo is, but what can you do? Um but yeah, I just need to like really stretch. My knees have been cracking. Not even cracking, just like feeling a bit tight and congested. But I've always had um like knee issues uh, ever since I played rugby. So it's not really soul cycle related. It just kind of gets a bit inflamed sometimes, especially when I run, which I haven't been doing recently. So but I do want to get back into running. But now it's freezing cold, so I probably won't. So I don't really know why I said that. However... I think my friends and I are gonna go to Sweat It, which is kind of like Barry's, if you know what Barry's is. Just like weights and running. But I think I do enough cardio, so I'm probably gonna do double weights. But I should probably go back to Barry's sometime soon, otherwise I'm never gonna go back. I've said this multiple times in videos, TikToks, podcasts. I literally used to go to Barry's all the time. And after the pandemic, I just never went back. Because I really enjoy running by myself. There's something about an instructor yelling at me, telling me to run, that just doesn't really do it for me. It does it for some people, doesn't do it for me. So, anyway, yeah. Um, and then, now I'm going to go to bed. It's literally like 8.45pm. Why am I going to bed? Because I'm tired. No. So true, Queen. Because you're tired. Listen to that body. Period. Oh, go off. Okay. Night. <laughs> oh, good God. <laughs> good morning. I'm actually running late. Um, I stayed in bed for a lot longer than I needed to. Um, and I also thought I fell asleep with my rings on and woke up without them on and started panicking. But I took them off before I went to sleep. We're on the last pack of antidepressants. My prescription needs to hurry up and arrive. Oh God, I hate being late. Being late is probably the one thing that gives me like the worst anxiety ever. Anyway, I just get dressed. Gonna go with this little number. This is nine. These are Lulu lemons. That light is annoying. Okay. It's so cold, but I don't want to wear a jacket. This is how my brain works. It's just ugh. being me is is stressful. I'll be real with you. It's very stressful. But. Yeah, let's go with this. I do love this sweater. It's not mine though. Uh, cute, cute. Okay, I need to put some shoes on and then I need to head out. Guess who's been a real shitty vlogger? Me, me. I well, my phone just dropped, so that further proves my point. Anyway, I think the last time that I filmed was um, when I was going to SoulCycle this morning, or when I was getting ready for SoulCycle. Since then, I have done two more SoulCycle classes. Um, oh my God, sorry. I just came home and inhaled spare ribs. Oh, oh, just inhaled them. And a chicken curry. Because honestly, I sat down in class. Sorry, still got ribs in my teeth. Um, I sat down in class and I was like, oh, you have not eaten enough today. This is not good. So as soon as I got home, I just, yeah, take from that what you will, because that wasn't great sign language. Um, but yeah, it's Thursday. Um, I was going to film when I, oh my God, can't stop laughing. I was going to film when I went to Notting Hill, literally got my camera out and then I bumped into Hattie, who I haven't seen in ages and we took class together. So kind of slipped my mind to be like, hey guys, I am with Hattie. Also, I don't think I would shove a camera in her face she's very camera shy um but yeah so since the last time there was a video clip um i took a soul cycle class in soho took one in notting hill then took another one in soho it was a taylor swift ride actually and we rode the soulful to all too well um 
I'm not a wooer. I'm not a, a woo girl. Um, in Soul Cycle classes, there are people who love to woo and whoop and cheer. Not me. Not me. I always look miserable. Yeah, so a lot of instructors have told me that I don't smile in class. But I did, in fact, have a great time riding to All Too Well. Probably didn't look that way. I did sing along, though, which is <laughs> rare for me. To quote Abby, my instructor, she did say the other day, she was like, yeah, Mary's really coming out of her shell. I'm glad it's taken me two and a half years. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let me just drink some water. What I wet myself tonight, we know why, huh? It's my second bottle of this. Whew. Because my skin is being a bitch to me. It's being a bitch to me. But, oh my god, I've got ribs under my nails. Listen, I'm just rambling because I'm tired at this point. Um, I'm not going to do anything tonight. I'm going to go straight to bed. Don't have a workout until 1pm tomorrow. I'm doing 1pm and 5.30. Yeah, and it's Drake versus The weekend, which will be fun. Oh my god, this is my life. All I do is work out. I don't even socialise at this point. Mm, 23. Well, guess who's not going to bed? I'm going to my friend's house. I'm literally still in my sports bra. Good morning. Happy Friday. Currently eating breakfast. Um, cinnamon bagel. And then I have... <laughs> I couldn't find a bowl. So I put yogurt and granola in a cup. <clears throat> and I need to um, kind of like clean my room and put my workout stuff in the wash. And then edit my podcast, which should have been up this morning. class really good really vibey as per usual and i just came home um and like laid in bed i wanted to nap and i couldn't <laughs> so now i'm going back to her 5 30 and everyone's having a really hard time getting to the studio today because um the tubes are on strike but not me not me anyway i literally look like i'm going to the grocery store at like 2 a.m for a tub of ice cream but I'm wearing my Lulu's underneath. I moved my camera so I could show you it from the front and I moved my body with it. Did I? Is there anything in here? And that is my week over and out. Just got home. I ate like four fish sticks in some avocado mayo. And I was like, that's not dinner. And so I put granola in a yogurt pot that was half full or half empty, depending on how you look at life. But yeah, that's my Monday to Friday, baby. Literally, I do the same exact thing every single day. Um, tomorrow I'm just gonna work out and Sunday I'm not gonna do anything. Mm. But thanks for watching, besties.